Saks bell room repairs using the Z60 and the power disc roller. For this case, we are going to use the mini roller, the curved dent roller, and the curved arm attachment. If we can get a close up of our bell, we'll show you the damage we plan to remove. So you can see this area in here has been flattened out. Occasionally, we will also get flat areas in this area from wedging our sax bells onto a wooden mandrel. This device will allow us to fix this the fastest possible way. We've already set up our mini disc roller and our cave to allow us to be right at the point. Once again, we work it like a steering wheel. We'll work it from the back side. We'll work from the rim and we'll work out. It is simply around the rim in the different areas that we're needing. Once we've achieved our goal, working around the lip of the rim, we will then back off our pressure. Readjust our mini disc. We are now able to work further in on the bell. reshaping the areas that we need. This obviously works better with a bell off or with the middle brace attached. And as quick as that, you can see that we've gotten most of it out. We could finish this off with a little bit more time and care, but the major curve has been returned, and we have our general round shape under our bell rim, as well as on the top, and we are all the way out to the rim. This is the key indicators of our repair.